the uninstaller. Um, this is essentially uh, D7's auto uninstall feature from the maintenance page, uh, stripped out and made into a standalone application for the purposes of uh, deploying, having it run silently and automatically uh, to uninstall apps via group policy or uh, pushing out or pushed out through your uh, remote monitoring software or what have you. In any, any way you can script it, you can run it. So let's get started. Um, if you're not familiar with the auto uninstall feature, first you have currently installed apps that are not in your definitions. Um, very few on this system because it's a fresh reload minus this ask toolbar. Then we have the currently installed apps that match your definitions and we have your definitions. Um, and essentially you would just uh, check what you want to add to the definitions add that to the removal list they appear there and they will appear in the uh, matching defs uh, tab and you can just select and click the uninstall button but that's not really what we want to do we want to get into the scripting aspect of it because that's the entire point of this program um, so before I show you the scripting let me show you the options um, scripting uh, any of the, any of the options on this page will require registration um, once uh, you have these options configured you'll essentially just run the uninstaller with the slash auto parameter as seen here and um, among these uh, options when it runs automatically you can have it save uh, to a log file which it will always append to never overwrite in the current directory or you can have it email you that log uh, on completion and you have your various settings to set up your email account here um, so I'm going to just go ahead and show you we'll save the definitions and we have Internet Explorer running with our ask toolbar and now we'll deploy, uh, we'll pretend to deploy our script with the uninstaller. Oh, wait, I forgot one crucial thing. I did mention it had to be registered, so I have to copy my registration information to the folder. And now I will deploy my script. It kills Internet Explorer. Um, it is silently uninstalling the Ask toolbar as we speak. And any moment I should get an email on completion. Any moment now. And there we have the email. And you see uninstalled ask toolbar, which is exactly what we wanted it to do. If you have any questions, um, please drop by the forums at foolishtech.com. Um, prefer you to use the forums because other people may have the same questions in the future and if they stumble across the forums then they'll have the answers and they won't have to wait for them. Uh, that's about it for this video. If you have... did I already go through that? Yeah I did. Alright, let's just call an end to it. Thanks for watching.